So I happen to think that Printful is one of the most overrated, overrated print on demand apps of all time. So now that uh, a lot of people might be upset uh, that I've basically said Printful is overrated, I think that it's interesting to look at, right? First and foremost, uh, Printful certainly is a great app. They'll make a great product for you, uh, all that stuff. However, they are a little bit pricey uh, and the quality isn't as, you know, it's not as, it's not better. It's, it's not as much better than everybody says. I'm not sure if that makes sense, but if you are using Printful and you're selling on Etsy, that's probably a good match. If you're using Printful and you're selling on Amazon Merch, it's probably a good match. But if you're using Shopify and you're using Facebook ads or Instagram ads or Instagram influencers, there's a lot of other apps that you can use. And what I want to do in this video here is I want to show you uh, not only actual print on demand products, I have some on the desk in front of me uh, that are from other print on demand apps, but I'm also going to take you into the computer uh, and we're actually going to look at some of them today. So if you're someone who is uh, starting a Shopify store uh, and to your knowledge, Printful is the only print on demand app out there, or you have been told um, by someone on YouTube that Printful uh, is the best. Uh, I want to kind of expose you to some other apps out there and possibly some better products that Printful does not have. Uh, and we'll jump into the video right after this. And if you guys want more content like this, you can subscribe uh, to my channel and you can also join my print on demand Facebook group. If you have not been exposed to the world of Facebook groups for Shopify and print on demand, uh, you should check them out because there's a lot of good resources there. I happen to have my own group. Uh, it is called print on demand ninjas. There's a link down in the description right at this point of filming this video. There's about 18,000 members. So if you want to interact uh, with a pretty active community, uh, check it out. The link is down in the description. So what the heck uh, do I uh, even have in front of me here? Well, what I have is several different print on demand products. These are from several different print on demand apps. And this is what we're going to be looking at today. Okay, so this pillow here, uh, and these mugs in this phone case, and this hat uh, is from the print on demand app printify. Uh, this cell phone wallet case is from the print on demand app WC fulfillment. Uh, and then this tumbler and this all over printed hoodie is from the print on demand app subliminator. And we're going to take a look at all uh, four of these apps today. I'm also going to show you some other ones. I have some other uh, close ups of these products that I'm going to show you in this video. Uh, so let's jump into it. The first app that we're going to take a look at is Printify. I have it on the screen right now. I'm actually an affiliate of Printify. They are the number one recommended app of podninjas.com. Printify is an app that I have used for a long time. I have some of their stuff on the desk right now. I've been selling with Printify since like two 2017 uh, and I love them mainly because of the pricing they have a lot of really great products and the pricing is really good especially if you're using that printify premium now I want to just I'll show you some close-ups of these products during this video so you can see uh, some of the quality here but um, these mugs uh, these are mugs that I send out to members uh, of my coaching program when they hit certain milestones on the store uh, on their store for sales uh, and you can see that these have a definite good quality to them the print is pretty vibrant uh, and I definitely think if you're selling mugs at all, uh, Printify is a fine supplier for you. Same thing with phone cases. This is a phone case here uh, from Printify. I'll show you some close-ups of it. Uh, they also, if we go into the accessories tab here, they have a whole bunch of different phone cases uh, right here. Some of them are as cheap as $7 uh, if you have a Printify premium account, which is uh, pretty much unbeatable. Uh, or if, you know, if not unbeatable, you can find uh, other apps that have cases for that price. But that's a really good price uh, if you're going to sell phone cases. Honestly, too, uh, if you are selling phone cases, it's not about the strength of the case. It's not about how good of quality the case is. People are buying your print on demand phone cases because uh, they like the design. They're not buying it because it's going to save their phone. If they wanted to save their phone, they would just go buy an OtterBox. Printify also does hats. Now we'll kind of navigate over uh, to the hat section here. Uh, they offer embroidery on five different types of hats. Uh, here's an example of their uh, dad hat here, I guess you could call it. Uh, they call it the twill hat here on the store. It's $11. 
uh, and 69 cents with a Printify premium account. The embroidery on it is is pretty good. Uh, I think if I was going to compare it to Printful though, uh, Printful is probably a little bit better. I do have some Printful hats on the shelf behind me, uh, which I will include close-ups of here in this video so you can see them. Uh, but like I said, $11 for this hat uh, with a Printify premium account and the embroidery, while it is a little bit not as good as Printful, it's still, you know, pretty good. You're not going to really see a lot of com customer complaints or anything like that. And the next app that we are going to take a look at uh, sells print on demand jewelry. Uh, this is a dog tag uh, from the print on demand app shine on and shine on is a print on demand app. I'm showing you them on the screen right now. Uh, they have a ton of different jewelry products and what's really cool about shine on is you can actually engrave uh, the back of most of their products uh, with any custom message so when your customer is purchasing they could, if they wanted to purchase this bracelet uh, they could add a custom message to the back and i will show you some examples of all of that uh, in close-ups throughout this video but shine on is a really cool app again i'm looking at them here uh, and you can get a bracelet like this for nine dollars and 97 cents which is really good because if you sell that bracelet for 29 or 34 or 30 uh, you can see that their recommended retail price goes all the way up to $75 and that means you can make a bunch of money, right? If you're selling print on demand jewelry, uh, I would definitely recommend checking them out. Uh, you can do a whole bunch of different stuff. They have necklaces, they have cross necklaces, uh, and they're based in the United States, which is amazing, right? Because you're not going to have to wait for long shipping times. They also have really good customer service. They're an app that I've used uh, for a long time. I'll just kind of scroll through uh, some of the products as well here. Uh, these products here, these are actually message card products. Uh, so you're actually selling the piece of jewelry that is shown here. Uh, and then what you're doing for print on demand is you're customizing the back of the message card, right? So you can put any message here. This is a great option because the niche ideas here and the gifting ideas right here are basically unlimited. And the next app that I want to take a look at is called Subliminator. Subliminator is is also an app that I've used for a long time. I have them on the screen right now. I'll just kind of scroll through some of the products uh, that they have. I think really uniquely they have uh, dog hoodies here, hooded blankets. They have really nice all over printed stuff, which is what this is right here. I'll show you some close ups of this throughout the video, but this is a hoodie. Now they also have this really nice tumbler. Now the print on this tumbler is probably some of the best print I've ever seen. I want to just pull it up here on the screen right now so you guys can see it. Uh, relatively fit fairly priced. I think the margins are going to be a little bit uh, tight on this if you're actually going to sell it on your store, but the print quality on this tumbler is amazing. I'm going to do my best to show you guys some good close-ups of this throughout this video. Uh, you can almost see the print being raised on it. That's how good it is. Again, I'm going to try my best to show you guys a good view of it. Uh, it is a stainless steel tumbler on the inside here. Uh, again, really nice tumbler overall. Uh, you can get both of these products and more from the print on demand app Subliminator. Now, some other apps that I wanted to mention, but I don't have any products from them in front of me here are T-Launch and Pillow Profits. Now, T-Launch is a really cool app that is based out of the United States. They have basically everything that Printful has and more. They have built-in personalization options. Uh, and they even have a really cool combo t-shirt feature. I'm probably gonna make a video on this uh, concept specifically in the future, but I just wanted to mention it here. I think I mentioned it in one of my last videos too, but you can basically sell t-shirts on T-Launch and they will bundle two of them together. So if you have a really cool idea where someone would buy two t-shirts at once uh, that both have different designs, then you can use T-Launch to really easily uh, fulfill that. The second app that I mentioned that I don't have products from in front of me here is Pillow Profits. I've used Pillow Profits for a long time as well. They do cost $29.99 to put it on your store, but they have some really unique products, mainly uh, their car seat covers. I'm showing some video footage on the screen right now. This is actually inside of my car. Uh, of the car seat covers, you can see that they definitely have a vibrant print. Uh, they're super high quality to the touch, like they definitely don't feel cheap. A lot of times people ask me if they feel uh, like really stretchy nylon or anything like that, and they definitely feel good, right? Like you obviously can't tell how they feel through the video, but they definitely feel high quality. One of the biggest selling points for these products is that they are only $35 uh, through Pillow Profits, which means that you can sell the pair for like 70 bucks and you can double your money if you make one sale, which is pretty much unheard of in print on demand. And the last app that I want to talk about uh, is called WC Fulfillment. I'm not really sure what is going on with WC Fulfillment. I've heard some people saying that they're sort of back to normal. I will say just a quick disclaimer, last Q4, uh, right now it's August, uh, so about eight months ago, this app 
basically shut down. Uh, there was people that were having orders taking one to two months to be received. They weren't receiving responses from customer support and things like that. Uh, but I am hearing that they're a little bit back to normal. So I guess use it as your own risk, but they do have uh, one of the most unique print on demand products out there. Now, this is a cell phone wallet case. I will show you guys some close-ups. It's basically a wallet that someone can put their cell phone in, which is really cool, right? There's a ton of niches that would love this. They also have some really unique stuff like skateboards uh, and cloaks and different things like that. I'll put some screenshots from their app up on the screen right now, but it's called WC Fulfillment. Again, I don't really know what's going on with it, if it's still uh, working or not. I know that last Q4, like I said, they did shut down, it seemed, uh, but I'm hearing that people are able to use them and having a little bit of success with receiving the orders in a timely fashion. Another product from WC Fulfillment is the laptop case uh, that I have on this laptop here. They actually sent me this uh, to review for them. I wrote an article on podninjas.com on it like about a year and a half ago, um, but they also have laptop sleeves, so you can see it on my laptop right there. Uh, really cool product high quality it's you know not a protective case or anything like that like if you dropped it it wouldn't save the macbook or anything like that but it is nice it's hard it, you know it feels like a 20 dollars case that you would get at walmart uh, but it, it's nice so there you have it folks i hope that uh most of you if you have still been watching this video that you're not super upset uh, that I'm basically saying not to use Printful. And that's not even really what I'm saying. I'm just saying that there's a lot more out there besides Printful. And the reason why I wanted to make this video is because like I said in the beginning of this video is my Facebook group is continuing to grow uh, at an extraordinary rate. Okay, we're getting about 500 members a week inside of it. And the amount of people that I see joining and aren't even aware that there are other apps out there besides Printful is mind blowing to me, right? So. I wanted to take the time in this video today to really showcase some of the print on demand products that I like to sell uh, and some of the apps that I like to use, right? So that hopefully your eyes can be open. This is certainly a, this is certainly not a, I hate Printful video, certainly not a video where I'm telling you not to use Printful. They're a great app, right? You can definitely make sales with Printful. They've been around forever. They have locations all over the world, right? They're definitely a great app. I'm just saying, I think they might be a little bit overrated. Uh, and if you agree with me or disagree with me, let me know uh, down in the comments. Hope you guys have a great rest of the day. Now, uh, if you want to come join us on Facebook and my Facebook group, click the link down in the description. Uh, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you later.